true crime in the streets of L.A. Activision, Vibes, the first bungalow, Chris, what up? They call it the City of Angels. Funny, in my 30 years here, I haven't seen a single one. My old friend Henry Wilson used to say, people dare to dream here. He liked that about L.A. I'd say, Paul, dreaming will get you killed. Maybe I was right. Nobody knows what happened to Henry all those years ago. But whatever it was, he didn't deserve it. Well, I ain't walking the beat no more. It's all new kids today protecting the fools from the wise guys, the crooks, from the psychopaths. Henry's oldest son, Nick, of all people, is one of those kids. I hear he's a hell of a cop, but will he live to see the sunset? I don't know. And there are times I just want to tell Nick, give it up, kid, go be a lawyer or a doctor or something, but it ain't my place. Besides, it would be a disservice to his old man. See, there are unanswered questions here, and I know that one day someone will get to the truth. What happened to Henry was a true crime, and if there's one man who deserves to find out the truth, it's his son, Nicholas Kang Wilson. This is his story. Prodigal son returns, huh? Hey, Johnson, since when does LAPD issue weapons to meter mates? Always quick to pick a fight, eh, Kang? Hey, Johnson, how about that time a straight bit you in a wiener, huh? Shut your mouth, you old loser. Up yours, pal. Oh, my, that chooch, Nick. Let me tell you, it's great to have you back. Whoa, George, you're jumping the gun. I haven't agreed to anything just yet. You should. It would have made your old man proud. If you were my boy, and you didn't take this opportunity, I'd beat the living crap out of you. Then you said, sure, I'll take the opportunity. Or at least cried like a one-legged man in an ass-kicking contest. Easy, old-timer. I just came in to brush up. Aim for the paper. And kid, maybe think about firing one piece at a time. Saves an arm for the senoritas, you know what I mean? Nah, double the pleasure, double the fun. If you got enough ammo, then. That <laughs> That's what Viagra's for, Sonny Boy. Jeez, Nick, security guards at the mall shoot better than that. Chief, I wonder how you found me here. Eh, George? Leave George out of it. Here. I'm sure you've seen all this. Five bombings this month, nine dead, all mom and pop outfits in Chinatown. You know it's the triad. Exactly. No one's talking, no one wants to touch it. It's gotten worse. I need an answer, Nick, now. Come on, Chief. I'm suspended. 
Remember? Nick, this is EOD, Elite Operations Division, a special unit with jurisdiction over the entire city. The badge is yours. Just say the word. I don't know, Chief. Nick, you can get closer to these guys than anyone else. Okay, okay. But I'm gonna do it my way. <sighs> Wouldn't have it any other way. Meet me at the station ASAP. All right, Chief. See you later, George. Come on, did you forget your way around town? Nice digs, Chief. Excuse me. Sure beats the old precinct. Nick, meet Rosie Velasco. Great, I'll have a cup of coffee, uh, black, no sugar. Nick, Rosie's your new partner. Well, in that case, make it a bourbon. Screw you. Chief, I've heard of this loose cannon and there's no way I'm working with him. Fine by me. You know I work alone. This is the way it is, Nick. Someone's got to keep an eye on you. I guess I should have read the fine print, huh? Oh, throw up. Come on, you two. Go grab a bite of the China Bistro. Get to know each other. Yeah, whatever. But you drive yourself, you got it? Suit yourself. <laughs> hey, Nick. Welcome to the EOD. Immediately. 